Hello, my name is Vaishnavi. I'm 15 years old, I live in Apex, and I go to Green Level High School. As I've gotten older, I've started to see how our world works in some areas that I haven't been exposed to earlier in my life. As I've continued to educate myself about the disparities in our world, I focused on the overlooked issue of racial discrimination. It was something that we experienced every day, but also something that we had turned a blind eye to. When I first started school in elementary school, a lot of kids didn't really know about these issues. They would make those insensitive comments because they just didn't know. And we would brush it off because we thought, oh, you know, it's fine, they're just kids. But they were never corrected of it. And as that person grew older, they didn't learn to not make those insensitive comments. The insensitive comments then led to bigger and bigger impacts without them even knowing. It didn't just impact the victim, but it also impacted the individual that made the comments themselves. I've heard both older and younger people talk about race, and most people don't have that sensitivity. It's something that's diminished in our world. My friend's parents, or even my friends sometimes, make these comments, and it'll just make me double take because I've grew up with these people my entire life, and I wouldn't really expect it, but that's just how our world works at this point. It just makes you wonder about the difference in setting. I think if I wasn't exposed to the same opportunities to learn and grow like advocacy programs, I would have a similar mindset. I think it's extremely important that people have the opportunity to grow themselves, grow around the right kind of people, and the right kind of resources to learn and educate themselves. I think with the current day youth, They've been able to create those opinions and those barriers at a young age. And the biggest outlet where young people are learning and forming views is through social media. And it's much earlier than we've seen in the past. You can already see that kids have created such strong opinions about people of different color and people coming from different backgrounds. It's really scary. And it's also really hard to change. I've even started an organization, like many other youth, um, to help train young people so that they can speak up about these kind of issues. I think it's incredibly important that youth step up now more than ever to first of all educate themselves, but also to educate others about just how strong and impactful their actions can be on others. It would be really great if we could have the funding to have mandatory training programs for teachers so that they could really be educated about what's going on. So that they're not just a teacher who teaches academics, but they also teach morals and how this world functions and how to be a proper citizen. I often ask myself what I want to be when I grow up. Honestly, I don't know. I want to become happy by making others happy, just like my grandfather. I want to help people and make sure that our future is brighter than it is now.